It's that time of year. Deer are darting into the road, leading to dangerous consequences. A man was hit and killed while moving one off the road just last week. The state patrol says it received nearly 2,800 calls for animals in the roadway so far this year. It's a similar pace to last year. John Lortzen shows us the damage that can be done and what drivers can do to protect themselves. I'm taking off the rear bumper on this Ford Edge. At Fix Auto Collision in Maple Grove, Taggart Fian is working on a vehicle with minor damage. It's an easier job compared to other cars and trucks that have come in recently, especially those that have collided with deer. It's a really amazing what a, a deer, an animal, can really do if you hit them at a good enough speed. A major reason why this is their busiest time of year. When the clocks go back, now we're driving in the dark in the morning, we're also driving in the dark in the evening. Post-harvest animals have lost some of their coverage, so they're on the move and they're unpredictable. Drivers have told owner Matt Fian that they've seen them come from the woods, the ditch, even from up above. The one that went through the windshield and in was actually jumped off of a bridge. Somebody was driving under the bridge and it came landing so they didn't even see it coming. It just fell literally out of the sky. Fian says vehicle damage can be extensive, ranging anywhere from $1,000 up to $15,000 or more. Maybe the deer hits here, but that's only the chest. So then the back swings around. And then as you're driving, it bounces all the way down the side. The best way to avoid these kinds of crashes is to make sure your headlights are clean, your tires have plenty of tread, and keep your head on a swivel especially at night. The state patrol says you shouldn't swerve to avoid a deer. Swerving can cause you to veer into oncoming traffic. It's an abrupt and scary situation for anybody driving a car. In Maple Grove, John Lordson, WCCO News. The state patrol also wants to remind drivers that deer are most active between the hours of 6 and 9 at night.